Hey Kristen, it's Alexa. Today is May the 13th and it is a Monday. I just got out of my color theory design class and we were working on finding different contemporary artists who we would sort of emulate their style in our final project. Uh, I think I'm gonna do Robert Ruschenberg mostly because she wouldn't let me do Blansky because he's a not he's not really non-objective neither is Robert but I could swing the style more easily. If you haven't checked out Blansky you really really need to he's a graffiti artist I'm sure you've seen some of his stuff online he's brilliant and I adore him he's incredible I want to be him. I feel like this is gonna be a short video today. Oh by the way when you're packing to come see me bring some sneakers and some jean shorts and maybe some plaid and also bring a kind of nice outfit because I might need to put you in my movie. So I got into my room and I realized that I had something that I kind of wanted to talk about. You see, something's been really bothering me lately. I know this is really, really sort of random, but I read this thing on Tumblr because I'm addicted and it was about how Robert Pattinson was ignoring a lot of the Twilight fans and then someone in the crowd screamed Cedric and he went over and he autographed something for that person. So everybody was like, yeah, haha, ha, Harry Potter's better than Twilight. Which, you know, it, it to me, it's a better book series, but I still liked most of the Twilight series when I read them. As you can remember, I really, really, really liked them. Up until the last one, oh my god, it's so terrible. But I like Robert Pattinson. Because I think he's a really talented actor and he's funny. He really is. What bothers me is that somebody posted something ranting about it and being like, you know, really self-righteous sort of the anti twihard hater sort of thing. Uh, which, you know me, I'm not big on hating the people who like Twilight because, you know, whatever, I don't give a damn. But this person was just very, you know, he, you... You can hate people who hate Twilight the right way and you can do it the wrong way. And they did it the wrong way. Basically what they were, they were blaming Robert Pattinson for, you know, ignoring a lot of his fans and like sort of just ratting him out on that. But you know, I don't, I don't blame him for doing that because Twilight, if he had let it, Twilight could have ruined his acting career. And you know, as an actress, that would piss me off. His fans have made everything he does about being Edward and he he was even going to stop making movies for a while until he got that other role in the limo movie. I don't know what that's about. It actually looks interesting. I'm probably going to see it. But everything was so hardcore Twilight. It was huge. There's such a, you know, strong hatred of it, but then there's also such a strong fan basis in it that it, it's hard to break out of. It's It's really hard to break out of something like that. And if it was me in that position, and I thought that all these fans were gonna, you know, cost me my career, and there's that one guy who, you know, comments on something that I really enjoyed and I really like to do, yeah, you know what? Why can't I go sign just an autograph for him, even though, you know, everybody else is there? I mean, not saying that I would, but I don't blame him for doing that. What do you think? I will see you tomorrow. Love.